Well, guys, it's another episode. I told you I was going to get back with you for a, a brief overview, a review of uh, of my, my boat. It's, she's a beauty. She is lovely. I was my knees was was shaking when I took it out on the water um, this this summer. It was it was it was awesome adrenaline rush for sure. But oh yeah, and uh, by the way, toy hunting not me. Luckily, you know my wife she had some free time and she picked up the rest of the of the stilt man wave. You gotta love it. That is awesome. But back to the boat. Um, yeah, this is my, my, my workstation where I do a lot of my um, sitting and thinking about how I should approach a situation. But again, um, it, this is, she's, a, she's a nice boat. It's a um, two-cycle motor, and it has a dual, dual prop. Dual props. Let me get in so you can see it better. Excuse my table. I got, I got, I have my toys and things out on the table. But yep, and then, then it has. Let's see, the electronics is um the 2.4 gigahertz um, receiver Traxxas from one of my RC cars. I put in the electronics myself, and uh, the uh, water pump for the um, cooling system for the motor, I took off and flushed and cleaned because it was sitting for such a long time. I'm not a mechanic, so I had my uh, carburetor rebuilt by a, a, a buddy of mine and I had a new throttle put on because the throttle originally that came on a boat was ancient. So I had upgraded to a more of a safety uh, precaution for running, running. But and then on my fuel lines, I had the fuel lines replaced because when I uh, cut the con old container out from it sitting for such so many years, maybe about 10 years, when I pulled the, the, the guts out, all, all the wiring just was brittle and it just fell apart in my hands. So I had all the lines uh, re uh, replaced um, and let's see what else, uh, uh, let's see, other, other, other than that, that, that was pretty good. She ran like a champ. I didn't go hard on it. Um, not much because I don't have any floaty devices and I didn't want to lose it, but she was, she, she stayed afloat and, and she, she's, she's a, she's a racer. I'm not going to say she's a winner, but she is a racer. Yes. It, it, it this is one of my uh, favorite toys or whatnot. But yeah, maybe this uh, coming summer for 21, I'll, I can get it out in the, in the water again, in the lake and, and see what she, open it up and see what she can really do, you know? But just another uh, hobby of mine, again, that, you know, I enjoy doing, it makes me happy. And yes, I'm from Detroit, Michigan. Gotta represent, gotta represent. But she needs a new a makeover because it was it's been like this from the original. But you know, uh, let me get it. I can't run it because I'm in the basement. I don't want to. My son's upstairs, and I'm luckily I have this time, and he's not down here. But again, yeah, you guys l uh, look me up at uh, Art Walk, and and check out my videos and 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 my and the things that I like to do. You know, but you know that's my other other um, baby. That's uh, let's see. The boat actually, I didn't tell you how, how long it's about four, four and a half feet, four and a half feet long. It weighs about um, about whew, sixty, at least sixty pounds. I know it's I, it's heavy for me, and I'm not a weakling. Weakling, and yeah, excuse the pink kitchen back there. That was a gift from us passed down and can't take any um, pass on anything that's free nowadays. But um, yeah, the boat, she runs good. She runs good. That's my other baby right here, Scarlet Witch. 
Maybe if I reach a thousand subscribers, I'll open Scarlet Witch up on live. On a live stream. How about that? Brand new. She not even opened. Scarlet Witch. Civil War. Mm-hmm. Then my, uh, my builder figures. My collection has grown pretty, pretty big. It's not the um, biggest as some of these guys I've seen, but, you know, I just... A lot of those guys I've seen motivated me to to, to, to invest in, in it more. You know, I didn't didn't know it was that big, but you know, and and the you have to excuse the aquarium because I was I was into fish, and I just got wanted to do something different, so I got rid of rid of, of the fish, and um, said I'll put my action figures down here and make some use of it that way. Less to clean, less to clean, but yeah, just watching YouTube and the other guys that collect and post, their action figures motivated me to, to try to do something. Even with a phone board has been new experience, you know, watching other YouTubers like, uh, let's see, Al, Al Figures, really awesome guy when it comes to dioramas. And let's see someone else from um, just, uh, Mike the Hunter, I haven't seen in a while. Awesome guy and content, you know. Uh, when his shelf, he said it failed. That took guts to say that it, it failed. But, you know, again, we learn through experience, you know. Yeah. But, you know, I'm going to uh, let you guys go. Um, I hope you like this uh, little short overview, review of uh, my anaconda. I'm a, I need to re do a new paint job on it. She's calling for it. Yeah, uh, guys, I hope you like. Um, subscribe. And if you got some ideas what I should call it or what I should paint it or what I should do to it, feel free to, to, to let me know. I'm very open for suggestions. So, all right, you guys get back.